hopefully when I get back, I'll try to encourage more of that, and hopefully we can solve the health care crisis before it gets any worse. Um, also with regard to the education, I said I'm on the education committee. We are going to try to do something with regard to student loan debt. It is a huge problem. I assume many of you out there, maybe yourselves, or maybe no relatives or friends, or maybe in their 30s or 40s and have huge student loan debt. The question is, what can we do to prevent this from going out of control in the future? Um, we are working on a bill on the Education Committee. I have two amendments that I would like to have attached. One of them I think I have a good chance at, and that is requiring the educational institutions to sign off before a student takes out the student loans. When I talk to educational institutions, they tell me sometimes kids, and I'll believe this because it happened when I was younger, took out student loans for more than they had to. The reason they do that is that they get more money and kind of help them with lifestyle and have a little more enjoyable life when they're 19 or 20 years old. It's, enjoy, you know, it's fun to have a more enjoyable life when you're 19 or 20, but sometimes the student loans you took out to get that life are not that fun to pay off when you're 35 or 40. So I'd like to require the colleges to get more involved before more student loans are issued. It's something I don't think will, I will succeed at, but I want to get the idea out there. I don't think it's a bad thing that colleges have to, have to in essence, co-sign for maybe 5 or 10 percent of the student loans. I think it would be a good idea because they would be more incentivized to make sure that their students get jobs, make sure they get internships, make sure they're directed in majors in which they can't get jobs if they have some skin in the game. So that's kind of what's going on.